Hello, I'm Atrilisium, and welcome to European Last 4 as Vijaynaga. We're doing pretty well. We just had a nice, successful war. We're going to take another successful war against Pestar. And then... We'll also take one against Muta. Actually, no. We'll take both of them at the same time. I can take them both with my hands behind my back. Yeah. What do you think about that game? Actually, no. We need to... I keep forgetting we need this to be called. It's so frustrating. Because I need soft layer. Because it's got gold. I just need that gold so badly. Oh well, until we get that, we'll uh, we'll just grab a star. The star, if you wouldn't mind, you're gonna die. I'll just go straight to war. Bam, done. Now they actually have two thousand men in there, which is bit too much for us to assault. If we manage to break the walls, we could probably try it a little bit later on. They must be right. Lose Diplo power. Lose prestige. Um, I will lose the prestige. Because I'm kind of need the Diplo power soon. There we go. Zero. Come on, the star. You're not meant to be holding out on me. And we took a loan. What? Why are we taking loans? Oh, we don't have the manpower to build our forces back up. That's annoying. Yeah, I guess we'll do this and we'll have to manually fix the units later. There we go, we're getting our money back now. That's annoying. Repay loan. Oh, we can't repay loan yet. God damn it. Soon. Soon. One more month. There we go. Repay loan. Bam. As for Bastar. Uh, no, I need to switch who has it to. Orisha. Star becomes part of Orisha. How much can we get as well? 115 dark hits. Not terrible. Yep. I'll go for that. Bam, done. Orisha's looking sexy, but unfortunately Orisha is not long for this world. Orisha! Um, improve relations. And five times speed. We need to get them up to the nice round number. I don't know why 190 is a round number, but, you know, it technically is a round number, but it's a nicer number. And we have cause. And we have a new mission. Incorporate Orisha. Ooh, actually, that's what I was planning on doing. Yep, I'll take that. And conversions. Yes, let's start converting. Straight away, we'll start with you. Oh, God, Connor, you have gold. You have gold. So good. I'm I'm so happy with that gold. We might actually just start building stuff to take advantage of it. Building constable on Ooh, actually we can build constable there for 1.1. Yeah, we'll build a constable there. We've earth ramparts everywhere, don't we? We should probably start with a few star forts in some places, especially on Golcana, considering it's gonna be really valuable. Um and a capital. Oh, we're out of gold. We'll get some more money soon. Come on, any more ducats? I also need you to like me more. Like me, like me. It'll cost me only 250... That's really cheap. I've got to say, that is really cheap. 250 Diplo power for the whole of Orisha. I'll take that in a heartbeat. Okay, sure. Natives lose the greatness and we get more goods produced. Come on. Two more months. One more month. Come on. There we go. Bam. Annex Vassal. Go. Mamluks tell us of civil war. That's a shame. Anyone strong in this area is a good thing for me right now. Uh, admittedly, you're a bit far from the Timurids to actually be, you know, particularly useful. Uh, Timurids... 
Uh, no, I'm not looking at causing claims. I want to look at rivals. Me, Commonwealth, I haven't discovered, and Muscovy, I haven't discovered either. Muscovy really hasn't got very strong, and they've not even touched the Uzbeks yet, I can see. Or well, they probably have touched them, but I, 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 not, just, they haven't taken large chunks, which is what I'd kind of be expecting by now. Muscovy's a bit slow. Uh, they're not even Russia. Eh, no, it's still a little bit early for Russia, maybe. Let's grab ourselves a Diplo Advisor. I will take Global Tariffs. More money from the colonies. Now, what do you need? Two and an extra cannon. Two and extra cannon. Why am I building the wrong thing? Why? 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 I'm terrible. That's why. Because it wasn't rolled up to the top. There we go. Two. And then a cannon when we've got uh, more manpower in stock. Manpower's going up a little bit higher now. Certainly appreciating the fact that it's, uh, you know, going up quicker. Ooh! Lose my cantalism? No, I'll lose Diplo any day. Sorry. Not any day. Most days. Not quite any day. Ooh, now we do have some uh, nationalists rising up. Back on the street. They took their time. They took their chances. They went the distance, and they don't like Vaginagar. And they died. In the eye of the tiger. Anyway. Um, you're back at full strength. You're back at full strength. Oh, I'm so close to being over my power projection limit. Do we still have the insult? No. It's time to insult someone. Ming. I've insulted you recently, haven't I? Oh, I need to come back. I've insulted you recently. I haven't insulted the Ming recently. Ming, you're fat! And your peasants look like... Peasants. They're revolting. No, no, literally, Ming. Your peasants are revolting. No, they're... They're, they're rioting, rebelling. They're, they're throwing over trash cans and stuff. They were also kind of uh, ugly and smelly. That too. Um, so, we are now at our 52, which is uh, pretty good. Uh, pretty, pretty good indeed. Pretty damn tasty, if I do say so myself. It's giving us plus one, plus one, plus one across the board. More population is always appreciated as well. How are we doing down here? We're getting there. I'd like to be able to declare war on them soon. Orisha, how's the annexation going? 20%. Fine. Hmm. I'd like to declare war somewhere, but honestly, I still think we have to wait for our manpower to pop back up. We have a conversion. Let's grab another one. Just keep converting away. How much money are we making now? 11. The Great Comet. What? A comet that's... <gasps> Mysterious phenomenon in the night sky has been interpreted as bad omens of signs of the end times. An exceptional noticeable such phenomenon was a great comet has been visible recently, causing more still than usual. However, it's taking the opportunity to closely observe the comet's movements. The result of the scientific work that tells much about the object's distance from us and dispels many old, old superstitions about comets. While it appears uncertain if comets will remember this in future, the comet has provided more insight than fear. Keep looking at the skies. We gain a stability that we didn't use because we we're at free already, but still. The Jiba Puri the nationalists in that area. Um six percent. That's fine. I'm not gonna raise the tonne anymore. I can't actually, so that's pretty much a moot point. How much would that cost? I wouldn't have any left. No. I need some left. Military tech, I will take the increase in military tech, allows us to build some musketeers and infantry. And you know what? I'm also going to get the upgrade for my admin, because I had is definitely falling behind there. New military? I will go for South Indian Infantry. Considering we are South India, it seems to be very fitting, at least. Oh! Oh, let me pause! I will take... I'll take Rebels. Un Stop unpausing! Really pissing me off! Yeah. Uh, we gain free prestige. Awesome. Hello, rebels. I have some friends who want to see you. Okay, so we have managed to call this. Hmm, where next? I think to here might be a good idea. That's Terry Incognita. 
Okay, well, we're going to need someone to uh, actually be able to move to the Terra Incognita. So let us grab those transport ships. Hello, transport ships. You've got to go a fair distance. I'm sorry about this. And then we'll uh, manually get them to explore. We could probably also do with getting ourselves a uh, explorer, an explorer, and getting him to do a little bit of a wander over here now. that We've got a, a lot more range. We can actually start having a decent look-see. Also, Japan, what is this? Your mana. Okay, so you haven't managed to get the whole of Japan, you know, unified yet, but you're doing your best. Korea's doing pretty well. Hi, Korea. Ooh, what about you? Korshin. Doesn't look like you're really in a nice place right there. Two province minor with uh, three giant guys completely circling you. Sounds a little bit painful. Especially considering if they decide to embargo you, you're like absolutely screwed. Not they would. What's this? Someone I don't care about. Okay, good to know. Could go down to Australia. They sometimes have gold. But no, I think going straight for the uh, Americas is probably a good idea. Right, so... We've got our unit going over across to there. Nothing we can do about that for the moment. We're getting ready to take on the Rebels. We need an fully operational battle station. We can just blow them up. Blowing them up works for me. Boom. And a military leader died. Yeah, at least it gives us an excuse to buy a new one. <laughs> just say that about everyone. Be like, ah, it gives us an excuse to get another one of you. It's fine. I wish I could take on the Timreds. I really do. We're under our force cap, but the Timreds are like 100, so... Hmm. Kind of need to uh, do something about that. Pause. Thank you. Uh, we're getting a lot of military points these days, at least. So, I'm thinking we need to do some more building. Anything that we can get a large amount of money in is always particularly tasty. There's a one there. A point nine. Point eight. I'll take the point eights as well. Training fields and so on. Uh, ooh, 27. I'll take the 19. Oh, I can't. Out of money. Oh, well. That should give us a nice increase to our manpower pool as well. 600 per turn. Well, five. 520. Not that great, actually. I was thinking that maybe, you know, we'd get a bit more, but it's not not very comfortable. Ooh. The poet, philosopher, musician, and composer Kanaka Dasa was called to some place until as a young boy he found a treasure trove of gold and became known as Kanaka Nayaka. Kanaka means gold in Canada. He never used the gold for himself. His full name, Kanaya Dessa, was given to him by a scholar. Okay, okay, okay. Um, we gain a philosopher. Or we gain 50 admin. I'll take the 50 admin. Honestly, a level 3 philosopher, I don't need. I can't really afford to go. I could afford to go with one, but I don't need the points as desperately. Building our infrastructure, being able to afford, you know, to rebuild our army is always good. And another general has died. Wow, they are just dropping like flies. So, we are ready over here. Let us grab ourselves. She let's not grab ourselves a conquistador yet. I'm going to build ourselves a Carval. We'll build that. We'll do some exploring of that, and then we'll pick the furthest point we can, and we'll head over. Kind of want to maximise our uh, expedition to the Americas. Make sure it goes as quickly as possible. Orisha is being eaten. This episode's pretty much a beating Orisha episode. Beating? I mean eating, obviously. Shifty eyes. Um, yeah, it's so cheap to eat them. Uh, you can't do it very often, but wow. I was thinking it would be a lot more than that. And they have a lot of, like, one tax-based promises, actually. That's why. I was thinking that it was, you know, European again. I keep thinking, oh, European provinces. But no. Provinces around here are fairly cheap. There's a lot more of them these days, though. They have uh, split the area up into a lot more provinces, but they are uh, a lot cheaper. Take inflation and diplo? No, I'll just take 
that I'm, I'm short on admin points. Grab yourselves an explorer. It's not a bad one, actually. And then... Have a bit of a wander. You should be fine. I'm going to micro you just in case. <gasps> yes, self-sustaining. That's really good for us. Not quite so good for the people in the area. Now, the transports I sent over there are unfortunately going to be... Uh, Somewhat delayed in actually having any uh, real impact because they're going to need to come over here. We've got things to do. <laughs> I should probably up the number of transports we have. Can you go further? You can go further. Find me the Americas. Ooh. Yes, that is going to be where we're going. Now you want to go back and heal up. You did a great job. Darley, who are you getting owned by? Oh, uh, Lazang. Disorder. Alas, some might have to burn. Damn, that's a shame. A damn shame, you could say. I like this tiny little province here. Hobbyo. It's like, I'm trying my best. He is trying. All, all more power to him. Oh, no conversion successful. That's going to take a little bit of while in Russia though, but that's fine. And you're healed, so let's send you out again. We're going to keep pushing onwards. The road goes ever on and on down to the door where it began. We can push on for another one, then we'll have to come back, I think. A little bit risky. Hmm. What about you? Terra Incognita. I wish it would tell you if it's even worth risking sending your guys over there. I think we'll have to go for Wake Island. It's only just within our uh, actual distance, so probably Wake Island is going to be the safe bet. I'm still transporting our ships over very slowly. Uh, ships? Troops. This is going to be the, uh, the second batch. They definitely need to be uh, repaired, these ships. They're actually getting a bit damaged. Okay, one more batch, and then uh, you can probably go back to getting ready to transport to Wake Island. I think we'll repair them before we actually do that transport. Oh, 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 oh. Ooh, getting really badly damaged there. That trip is costing them. I think once we do this final leg, we'll have to get them repaired. Yeah, look at that, 12. Suddenly they take 12 in that one province. Really painful. We made it, at least. That's what counts. Go there and repair. Now. Hello. 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 I'm here to declare war. Holy war! that simple. We just go there and we're like, hi, we would like to take your province off you. Yep, that's cool. That's cool. Good. Now, the issue is, uh, we don't have the European ridiculous supremacy, so I'm going to have to be a little bit more conservative in how I play this. But not a lot. And by not a lot, I mean grab ourselves a conquistador, just in case. You are shite. You should be ashamed of calling yourself your conquistador. You are still pretty poor, but we'll, we'll roll with it. We are one leader over our power projection. That's fine. I'll keep him for the moment. I probably want him to be able to take the other guys to the other place, Wake Island. Oh, no, 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 no. No, you don't. I don't know if we're going to get there in time. We did. We lose stability or reputation. Uh, I will lose the legitimacy. Oh, stop unpausing my game. Really, really need to stop that.
and they went around behind me. I've got to give them, you know, that. They're, they're clever. And they completely destroyed my army, which means that I need to get a second colonizing army. That's fine. We'll, uh, we'll build a second colonizing army. We'll also grab ourselves a new Diplo advisor because he seems to have died. Colonial range plus 20%. Okay. I think we're not going to Wake Island anymore. We'll do that. And then we'll come back. Hopefully we'll survive the trip. If not, I don't really mind. It's fairly cheap. Um, ooh, we're getting up there in money. Getting embassy might be nice. Hmm. You're frustrating me. We will actually build our new unit on Madagascar. Because we can. More so than anything else, we can. So we will. Also, it's closer. But in this war... Ooh. Okay, kill was moving up. In this war, we're going to take our nice bit of gold, and then, uh, well... <gasps> Spain! France! Westernization is soon to be here. What we'll do is we'll grab the France in between them, and then we'll westernize. Hmm. Maybe not in between them. Gives us two people who might attack us. Probably just on the edge or something. Yeah, probably there. Ivan Elysium. Hope you enjoyed this episode. If you have, please remember to like it. That really helps out. And if you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing. The next episode, we'll grab Orisha. That's pretty much guaranteed. We'll start making our way to the Americas. That's pretty much guaranteed. And we'll start the process of considering westernizing. It won't happen immediately. But uh, it will certainly be a nice thing to have. But until then, I've been Enter Elysium. And stay shiny.